Hello everyone. In this video, we are solve a nice German math Solomon question. It is a nice junior math Solomon question who says x to the power 6 minus 64 is equal to 0, x is equal to what? How to solve this exponential math problem? But first of all, if you think x is equal to 2, you can see easily 2 to the power 6, it will be 64. 64 minus 64 it will be 0. So you can see easily our final answer x is equal to 2. But if you think x is equal to negative 2, this time you can say easily minus 2 whole to the power 6. 6 is an even number, so it is always positive. So it is 64 minus 64, it is also 0. So you can see easily our final answer x is equal to plus minus 2. But this exponent is 6, this is x to the power 6. So you know that here 6 root, our 6 solution, we are find out six solution in this exponential math problem so let's start solution i think others four root is complex number okay so here solution here x to the power six minus 64 is equal to zero now at this moment you can see here x to the power three and whole to the power two minus a to the power 2 is equal to 0. We know that here 2 times 3 it will be 6 and here 8 to the power 2 is 54. So we know that a square minus v square it will be a plus v times a minus b. If I follow this formula this time I can see really here a is x cube and b is 8 so a square minus v square it will be a plus v times a minus v is equal to zero. Now we'll find out here is two cases. Our first case is x to the power three plus eight is equal to zero. And we'll find out other case it will be x to the power three minus eight is equal to zero. Now, at this point, I can see this expression here, x to the power 3 plus 8, it will be 2 to the power 3 is equal to 0. We know that a cube minus v cube, if I follow this formula, a cube plus v cube, it will be a plus v times a square minus ab plus v square. This time, you can see this expression x plus 2 then here s square minus a b plus b square it will be x square a b 2 times x it will be twice x plus b square i mean 2 to the power 2 will be 4 is equal to 0. now here x plus 2 is equal to 0 in other case it will be nice quadratic equation this quadratic equation it will be x square minus twice x plus 4 is equal to 0. Now here, x is equal to minus 2. And in this case, you can see that here is a is equal to 1, b is equal to minus 2, and c is equal to 4. Now here, x, it will be minus b plus minus square root v square minus 4ac over 2a. If I apply this formula here, this time you can see really here x is equal to minus b it will be minus 2 plus minus square root b square i mean minus 2 whole square minus 4 ac a is 1 and c is also 4 over 2a a is 1 now at this moment i can say here x it will be positive 2 plus minus square root and we know that it is even for even number here exponent so it will positive 4 and here is 16 so 16 minus 4 it will be negative 12 because of that here is 4 times 4 it will be 16 so 16 minus 4 it will be negative 12 over 2 then you can see here x it will be 2 plus minus square root negative 12 so you can see it will be square root 4 times 3 times minus 1 over 2 because of that 3 times 4 it will be 12 and here is minus 1 now at this moment you can see here x it will be 2 plus minus 2 square root 
3i over 2. Square root 4, it will be 2. Square root 3, it will be 3. Square root negative 1, it will be i. Then if I divide this below by a, 2, so it will be 1. If I separate this fraction, plus minus square root 3, i. This is our two solution. Both are complex number. And this is real solution. X is equal to negative 2. We will find out this is first of all. And this is our other two roots. This is our other two answer. Both are complex number. And other case we will find out here x to the power 3 minus 8 is equal to 0. How to solve this question? So here is three roots. So you can see easily here x cube minus 2 to the power 3 is equal to 0. So a cube minus v cube. So we know that a cube minus b cube, it will be a minus b and a square plus a b 2 times x, it will be twice x plus v square. I mean 2 to the power 2, it will be 4 is equal to 0. Then you can see easily here x minus 2 is equal to 0 and other case we'll find out x squared plus twice x plus 4 is equal to 0. Now at this moment you can see here x is equal to 2. This is our real solution. This is the value of x in this exponential expression. But here you can see here a is equal to 1, b is equal to 2 and c is equal to 4. Every value is positive value. But we know that here x it will be minus b plus minus square root v square minus 4ac over 2a. a is 1. I apply this formula here. Now, you can see here x, it will be minus 2 plus minus square root 4 minus 16 over 2 times 1, it will be 2. Then here x, it will be minus 2 plus minus square root 16 minus 4 it will be minus 12 over 2 then i can see easily here x it will be minus 2 plus minus square root negative 12 it will be 2 square root 3i here so it will be 2 square root 3i over 2 then if i divide this value by this 2 it will be x is equal to minus 1 plus minus square root 3i this is the value of x so we we'll find out here x1 it will be 2 x2 it will be negative 2 and x3 4 it will be 1 plus minus square root 3 i and x2 3 4 and 5 6 here minus 1 plus minus square root 3i this is the value of uh, x here is 6 root it is uh, x is equal to 2 and x is equal to negative 2 both are real solution and here is 4 solution is the complex number thank you all if you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel for others interesting video goodbye take care